Hey guys, me here again, and today I'm just going to do a nice little mod showcase in my world of this revolver mod. And for some reason, it gives me coins. <coughs> oh, wait, that's my other mod. Yeah. Let me introduce you to Barry the Barman. Hi, Barry. So Barry the Barman is a dwarf. Ooh. Well, thank you. I'll put my currency up there. Okay. That's very nice of you, Barry. Okay, what's down here? Ooh, Oculus. Hello, Teholis. Hey, he knows who I am. Yay. Huh. I heard there was someone you can hire around here. Pretty big fa oh. Hello, Gallius. I'm glad I won't. Okay, let's go exploring then. You're a big fella, aren't you? You think? I sometimes agree with Gallius though. There's a weird glow over there. Hmm. Interesting. Hey, Dad. Good in time, Cameron. Okay, I'll cook in a minute. I'm just recording a bit. Oh. You have to go and get some other ingredients. Huh? You have to go and get some other ingredients. Okay. Um, I'll be done in a minute. I've just got to. Watch your hands. Finish this dungeon. Okay. Oh, hands, hands. So many bandits. Thanks, Gallius. Ooh. Skyrim. Quote there. Bandit leader. You give me gold. Well, that was easy with the revolver. Oh, um, if I didn't tell you guys, this is the editable NPCs mod. Yes, Gallius, I know. Um, you can create your own NPCs and stuff. I'll give you a nice little tutorial of that just now. So, we'll just go over here, set it today. So 
with this modification you get this NPC wand. Right click and then Traveller. Then I'm just going to select the skin. So let's go with God, Steve too. Right now, pick that. I can just go to um, select cape. My mind concave. Then just go stats. Find spec. He walks around. Give me down and sword. Um now you can go to advanced and choose what lines he says. So world. Takes a bit to remove the text. So. This was inevitable. And then you can just use the faction, whether it's friendly or neutral. Is neutral. And just go to global. Um, you can change his role here whether he's a guard, an item giver, a trader, a mercenary, a banker, or a transporter. I'm going to make him a trader so for. Give you one leather pork iron chest plate. So you can just drag whatever in there. Make sure he has the actual items. Going into his inventory, leather, a couple of bows, a couple of chest plates, and a stack of pork. And then you can just do whatever really. 
um, you can change his height all the way up to 15, which I wouldn't suggest because that's how big it is. You can make his height go all the way down to 1. And look how small he is. I'm going to put him back to default. And this is the NPC cloner. Right click the one you haven't cloned and choose the slot for it to go in. And you can also just right click and spawn one from earlier. Thank you, Gallius. So, yeah, guys, this is the NPC cloner mod, and what I meant by they'll turn hostile. Oh right, okay, yes, of course. Made up all this stuff. I think you can make it so he doesn't, but I haven't learned how to yet. But anyway guys, um this I'm Ter Hollis and this was my well, I'm Hollis and this is my video on the MPC editing mod. And the revolver mod, which I didn't show guys, but I used. Yes, Gallius life is a bit. Got 39 days left. So as we're saying guys, goodbye.